Grounds live in Citrus Heights with this door opening fundraiser. Hey, Camby. Good morning. So this started at 6 a.m. This is where everybody has been checking in. And for every single person that walks through the doors at Stone's Gambling Hall, literally they can walk in and just walk right out. A hundred dollars is being donated to Weave. They even have a countdown going. We're at 23 hours and eight minutes left for people to come in and do this. So it's until six o'clock tomorrow morning. You still have a lot of time to be able to get on out here. Julie is with Weave. This is such a big deal for you guys to be able to get this money. What will you use this money for? This money funds our 24 seven crisis response services, crisis hotline, emergency shelter, mobile advocacy. The reality is um, domestic violence, sexual assault, don't happen between eight and five. Um, so we visit there 24 7 too. You know, I was reading on your guys' website, one in four people will be a victim of domestic violence. I think with this uh, Me Too movement that we've been hearing about, how much have you guys been inundated with more people reaching out to you? We're definitely seeing more people realizing that they were impacted by sexual or domestic violence in the past. But the reality is for 40 years, we have been the safe place to tell those stories, and we will continue to be the safe place for those stories in the future. Yeah, we are so blessed to be able to have Weave here, but of course, we're not able to do it without funding like this. This is the first time a business has done something to this degree. Ken Cooley, this is your area here. Correct. Why is this such a big deal for Stone's Gambling Hall to do something like this? Well, I think the to jump out and commit $75,000 to support Weave, this supports counseling sessions, the 24-hour call line, any sort of professional support services, visit with an attorney, safe house. There's so many functions. And to have Stone's Gambling Hall here in Citrus Heights at, at uh, uh, oh, gosh. Are you trying to give the address? Because I'm trying to give the goodness address. Goodness gracious knows I don't know the address either. You know what? You can see it from the freeway, people. It's right off of 80. Yeah. Antelope, 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 get off, get off 80. on Antelope. Just coming up get off on this. Antelope. <laughs> it's right here at Antelope and Greenback. Anyone comes in 24 hours. Stones has committed $100 for every person. And we're just going to watch the totals jack up all day to get to $75,000 to support this great work of Weave in its 40th year. This is its 40th anniversary year. I love that. Okay, by the way, if you're wondering why Ken is um, stumbling over his words, that's because he's committed to be here all 24 hours. <laughs> is that, that's not right? The way you said or it on TV, it must be true. Is that, a work day down oh, at the he has a work day at the Capitol. Darn it, darn it. Well, you can still get on out here. Uh, the clock is ticking down. All they need you to do is come in, sign in. $100 is going to go to Weave to give them a total of $75,000. Dollars, uh, which they can definitely use that money. So we want to see you out here. Also, if you've never eaten here, I'm having the best cheese pizza of my life for breakfast this morning. Oh boy! So, oh boy! I mean, breakfast of champions. That's right. That's right. <laughs> I can't be. Thanks. Where's some nutrition in, in there?